My server events don't work. There is a huge problem. I test my events and there's nothing there. What's going on? Well, this might be related to something um, quite interesting and uh, I want to show you uh, what I mean. It's about a, a sort of delay that Facebook has when reporting um, server events in the testing tool. Let me explain. So, uh, I'm in my events manager. I'm on the test events page. So, from here I can um, start to test my events. All I need to do if I use Pixel Your Site, and all you need to do if you use Pixel Your Site is to get this code from here. Make sure it's the latest code because Facebook uh, changes this code. So, refresh this page and to add this code inside uh, the Pixel Your Site plugin. We have a dedicated field for uh, the testing code is right here. Uh, after you're done with your testing, remove the code. Okay, save. You probably already know how to test your server events, but in case this is your uh, first time here, uh, this is what you need to do if you are a Pixel Your Site user. And now you simply start to uh, fire events on your website. Just uh, browse your website uh, like a user would do. So I'm here. I'll add to cart. And now let's go in the um, uh, events manager. And as you can see, all I can um, see here are browser events. No, there is no um, server events. And why is that? Well, the thing is, you just need to wait and uh, easily the server event will catch up. Um, so, yeah. Now I can have, uh, I can see the server events. Easy. And eventually all the events that I have will be the duplicated. I will have a, a, the usual pair of events, browser events, server events, and the, the server events will be the duplicated. So, yeah, that's what's going on. Um, the server events work, but there is a delay with Facebook when you test them. Okay, so that's it. It's not, a, it's not an actual problem. Just be patient. Don't um, panic. Don't uh, go on our help page and ask for help because it's not a real problem. Now, if you test on a live website, you will see real life events as well but you will not see browser events because um, the testing tool only reports browser events fired in the same browser session in my case this session here if i have a, a tab like i do with the website those events are reported by the testing tool but if someone else or me uh, visit the website um, in a different browser window those browser events will not be reported. However, the server events will be reported and most of them will be deduplicated. So if you have a website with normal traffic, you will not see everything so clean as I have here. You will have your testing test events like I do, and they will be uh, a pair with browser and the server event, the server event, event being the duplicated, but you will also see server events fired by your uh, normal visitors and most of them will be duplicated some of them will be processed when the browser event wasn't uh, fired for some reason uh, one more thing like this video and subscribe to this channel because i have this crazy plan to become a youtube celebrity by making facebook pixel videos which is not exactly an easy way thank you again